If you didn't hear the news, Gwyneth Paltrow and Chris Martin split after 10 years of marriage. The report was confirmed officially via Gwyneth's website, goop.com. Now, what has most people talking is the name of the post, Conscious Uncoupling. Quote, it is with hearts full of sadness that we have decided to separate. We have been working hard for well over a year, some of it together, some of it separated, to see what might have been possible between us, and we have come to the conclusion that while we love each other very much, we will remain separate. The statement, which by the way is actually signed Love, Gwyneth and Chris, goes on to say that they're parents first and foremost, and they ask for privacy on the matter. As a reminder, they have nine-year-old Apple and seven-year-old Moses. Chris and Gwyneth got married in December 2003, and a lot of people are saying that this seems more like a divorce than a separation, but clearly that D word has not been used. There are rumblings that Chris might be heading back to London while Gwyneth stays in the States with the kids, but then again, TMZ reports that Chris made an offer on an LA house last year for his bandmates and him, but it didn't actually go through and the couple did purchase a home in Malibu last month. And since it has a masculine design, the report suggests that maybe Chris will actually live there. I've said it before and I'll say it again. Everyone deserves love and we are wishing the best for this family. On a side note, even though this was officially announced on Paltrow's site, we hear that Vanity Fair actually had the full story and they did not run it at the request of the star. All right, everyone, so that is it for now. Leave your comments on the news below and click right over here if you wanna check out the nine reasons you should still love Justin Bieber, especially with all of the legal trouble he's been getting into as of late. I'm your host, Dana Ward. Thanks so much for checking out Clever News. We'll see you next time.